As my art practice progresses, I like pushing the conceptual development behind my artworks. And I like making artworks now that have multi layers of meaning. I really like using metaphor and symbolism in my works now. And some of the subjects I've covered recently have been mortality, connection, war, and place. I like referencing previous careers I've had with imagery that perhaps only other veterans from those industries would pick up on. Drawing and making have always been strong constants in my arts practice. I think I find making 3D forms more challenging because they are inherently more complex. And when I was given my boat, I immediately recognised the skeletal frame that the vessel had. For the last couple of years, I've kept virtually every stencil from every tattoo I've done. I decided to clad the hull with used carbon sheets from the stenciling process and to construct the sail out of the used stencils themselves. This created a direct relationship between the two materials and of course the real physical relationship to the tattooed clients. It was quite a nostalgic experience sorting through all the stencils from the old tattoos, uh, remembering fondly many discussions and, and the clients that I've had over those years. I found it interesting that on the carbon paper especially there was overlapping imageries from where I'd reused the carbon paper again and again, connecting images together the same way that tattooing connects my community together. This has been a really interesting project to be part of. Does place matter? I've really enjoyed the reactions to the work in progress where clients I've tattooed can identify the stencil that was used for them and how they're now part of something bigger than what they originally thought they would be by just getting a tattoo for themselves. Somehow they can see now very physically that they're related and connected to other tattooed members within the community. Communities need to exist in places and I think as part of our community we can all probably do things a little, a little bit better in terms of minimizing our social and environmental impact and not just for our community now but for successive generations. <laughs>